so I figured we'd come to our spot. Someone is ripping it. Look, watch. Skirt, skirt. There's actually so many people in this parking lot. Like, I don't understand what anyone's doing. There's nothing open but the veterinarian hospital. I'm locking my doors because you really never know what could happen. I've had a crazy day. Here we are, Slurpee Emo O'Clock. Maybe that's just my brand. No more excuses like, oh, here I am again, drinking a Slurpee, talking about everything. That's just my brand. I've just had the worst menstrual cramps all day and just emotional oh, the pizza place is open the one i'm in front of i'm also gonna pick a different spot i'm gonna pull a i'm gonna pull a 180 and uh oh honey that's a 360 i don't know so i go to 7-eleven right i only get a medium slurpee because i'm you know, I'm pulling up so often, who needs a large? But, I was actually thinking on the way there, I'm like, I kind of want a large, but don't do it, don't do it. I roll up, they're out of medium cups. What other choice do I have than to get a large? So today, I got my mukbang. All the stuff I ordered is Pepsi, lime, Pepsi. Oh my god, lime, Pepsi. <laughs> I always like getting Pepsi, but like a little pop of color. You know what I mean? Like that's just my go-to. Anyways, I had the worst cramps ever today. For a second, I was like, is there any possible way that I am pregnant and I am giving birth right now? These are contractions. That's why I've been so bloated lately. This has happened a few times before my cramps have been so bad that I've convinced myself that I'm giving birth. Cause you know, there's that show, didn't know I was pregnant. First of all, how the fuck? I don't know if that show's made up. I feel like a little bit better once that fourth Advil kicked in. I don't know if it's just me and my bad eyesight, but I could have sworn a girl just drove by on a bike wearing a mask. Like one of those white masks. I completely lost my train of thought. What is going on in this parking lot on a Saturday, ladies? I do not know. The oh, fuck, is she going to the veterinarian hospital? Oh, you know what's over there? There's a bank, there's an ATM, and it's a Saturday night. Everyone needs cash? Fucking 10.40 p.m. Everyone needs cash, I understand now. I'm still not understanding the girl on the bike, and I don't think I like it either. Anyways, I'm a fucking mess today. Like, I went to the beach yesterday, forgot to put sunscreen on my face, which I just have this fear of aging my face. Like, I want to keep my youth forever. So once I realized that I forgot my sunscreen in my car, which we took my friend's car, and I left all the stuff that I brought for the beach in my car, um, typical. By the time I realized it was a little too late, couldn't go back and get it, but I burned my face, which... I hate the look when my face is super red. Putting makeup on a burnt face just looks worse than not putting makeup on a burnt face. I just have to embrace it so I didn't put any makeup on today. I put mascara on because I was like, I'm gonna try to do the no makeup makeup look, but instead I just look greasy. So, I'm really concerned about the girl on the bike with the mask. Oh, she was just really pale, but like, anyways, I've been feeling unnecessarily anxious tonight. And I watch a lot of crime shows and crime documentaries. In fact, that's pretty much all I watch besides like YouTube videos. And lately on YouTube, I've gone to a rabbit hole of watching videos of people like converting their van into a house. I don't know even where that came from, but suddenly that's all I watch. And crime documentaries, which I watch all the time and I never feel anxious. Well, that's a lie. I didn't even watch anything like too out of the ordinary today, but for some reason I've just felt very like, I went for a walk tonight at sunset and for some reason I was like looking behind me like every 20 seconds. And that's when I decided to go to get a slurpee but suddenly there's a girl with the mask on riding her bike. I honestly think the reason why I feel more anxious and this sounds so stupid. I was watching a show called Confession Tapes. It's about how like the police trick people into confessing or trick people into believing that it, they did do it and then they confess to something they didn't do the episode that i watched had to do with like a fire and for some reason fire always gives me anxiety like i don't know why fire this is the most boring video like why am i talking about fire giving me anxiety but do you remember franklin the show i think this is the last thing i'm going to say before i go because at this point y'all are going to be like what, what the fuck? fuck i used to watch there was this episode of franklin that used to scare the shit out of me now the word franklin and scaring the shit out of me shouldn't be in the same sentence why would franklin ever scare me but there was this one episode where franklin 
walk up to the fire department down the street and there was a big fire and for some reason i am so fascinated by fire but so scared of it for some reason like i don't know same with aliens same with trains same with tornadoes those are like my four the girls i used to always want to watch that episode of franklin with the fire but it would always scare me and now i feel like this is that all over again just the adult version now it's not on that i'm gonna go home <laughs> Ah, I've had enough of myself and yes so thank you for watching <laughs> if you are still bye